five years ago, we were told that due to cost saving measures, um, the uh, council could no longer afford uh, the tourism offices in the market towns in, in their district. And unfortunately, funding was going to have to be withdrawn and we would presumably close. Uh, we got together as a tourist information uh, with all our volunteers and decided that we'd like to keep ourselves going. I set about getting local support in the form of money and after one month of going round I reckoned I had enough money to keep us going for one or two years anyway. We got help from the council in that um, our office is here, we don't pay rent for, so the council has helped us in that respect. To take it away is very self-demeaning and uh, it wouldn't have been appropriate. That's why I was so concerned that we should keep it going. To cover our costs, we obviously accept donations, but our main fundraising efforts, we organise fundraising dinners. This worked very well. I've had as many as 94 people come on one occasion, never less than 70. We, we fund and raise enough money to, to cover our costs and keep ourselves going. You've got to have a, a, really, a body of really keen volunteers. I think the volunteers who come here um, get uh, time to relate to the public yeah, and an opportunity to be of use yeah, and to use their skills. The volunteers like coming, they carry on coming. It's a social event for them. Um, they feel they're giving something back to a community which they love. But volunteers have got this natural enthusiasm. If, if the authorities use that enthusiasm constructively, then both parties can work well together. We get a great variety of people coming into our office, local people after bus timetables or telephone numbers. We are a central information point for the, for the area, really. We have Austra people from Australia, from Canada, um, checking on their routes. We have a, um, a website, we have an easy mold leaflet, for example. We try and produce a range of uh, information sources f for anybody who comes in here. It's a lovely thing to do because if you love your community, you're giving something back to it. And it's a pleasure to satisfy people's requests. Work with your local authority. Find the people who want to support you and stick with them. Show the council that you want to be positive but that you also need their help. The, the benefits that our operation, our tourist information centre gives to our, our local community, the town and the villages, it gives a certain um, kudos to the town. We're well supported and very popular in the town, so I think we do mean, mean a lot.